yeah, it's a it's a good reward for a very hard long winter. Um, you know, you train for six months, seven months through the winter. Uh, it's almost a pre-season, but you're, it's a, you're in a constant slog, you're in a constant grind, and you can kind of lose sight of what the end goal is. And today is a small step along the way, like you said, to hopefully selection and, and medal winning crews at Rio. I think today is the first tick in the box. Um, I do feel one step closer to Rio, even though it's just the, the European announcement. You know, it really gives you this long-term perspective and it's sort of saying this is likely to be what the team's going to look like. So it's really exciting. There's, you know, a really, really strong team down here at the moment. I think um, you're really nailing down some of the selection decisions. Uh, you know, the decisions were certainly not known beforehand. Um, and so I think that it is, it's, it's really nice, um, very encouraging at this point to, to kind of be told that, yeah, we're going to the European Championships. This is the first opportunity to kind of put Mark down and, and see whether the people who have been selected uh, are going to be making those boats more fast in Rio. I think university sport is a great place because people can either pick up new, new sports, meet new people, um, kind of do something uh, on a Sunday morning after a big night out. For, for whatever reason you want to be in that sport, there's something for everybody. Bucks is, um, you know, a great event. There's a lot of high quality rowing there and um, a lot of the guys here have come through r really strong university programmes and competed at a high level at Bucks and that's, you know, all of that kind of racing is great preparation for international racing. I mean, it's exactly the same distance, 2,000 metres, six lane, close tight racing it's what we do here and you know the more you can do the better basically and Bucks is just a great great platform for a bit, bit of high pressure racing. University rowing took me not only from being um, you know not an athlete and not a, to a student to being a good student and, and a good athlete at the same time to the point where you know I, I, I went to university originally in London but then did well enough to have an opportunity to go to Oxford and did the boat race and you know I owe so much to university rowing I you know it's inconceivable how much I owe to it.